Take a look at the view from our KXOY Air 4 drone as crews build the largest solar farm in the state of Washington. The major project going up in Lind, a small town known for its annual combine demo derby. Well, now the Center for a New Future for Alternative Energy in Washington. And KXOY 4's Ariana Lake takes us to the solar farm in a story you'll see only on KXOY 4 News. In a place known for fields of wheat, something new is sprouting up. History is being made in Lind. I'm standing on the edge of the largest solar farm in the entire state of Washington. It spans more than 200 acres and includes more than 81,000 solar panels. There's a lot of interest in renewables. It's that demand that prompted Avista to get behind one of the largest infrastructure projects Adams County has seen in years. Avista doesn't own the solar farm. Instead, that title goes to a North Carolina company called Strata Solar. They chose Lind because there was plenty of land to build on. It was near a Vista infrastructure, and it's sunnier there than in most other places in Washington. It's exciting for us to uh, to be a part of uh, the state of Washington moving forward with its partners in the in a Vista and the community here in Adams County. Uh, and we just like being a part of uh, progress. That progress comes in the form of enough panels to power 4,000 homes. But the power isn't actually going to homes. Instead, it's destined for some of Avista's biggest customers who are part of the company's Solar Select program. We have 60 customers that have signed up from municipalities, cities like the town of Lind, for example, universities, as well as some of our commercial and industrial customers. The great news for those customers is they're going green without paying more. The legislature recently passed a bill that promotes local renewable energy by providing tax incentives. So those customers won't see any cost differential. That's something Avista is excited about as the landscape and future of energy changes in Washington. But we're seeing a, a greater appetite. Uh, and not only is it the right thing to do environmentally, but, but economically it's becoming a, a better option for everyone. And we're just very excited to be a part of that. The Solar Select customers can expect power from this solar farm by the end of this year. So we're hopeful. Time for Christmas lights. The project's ribbon cutting is set for October 23rd. Reporting in Lind, Ariana Lake, KXLY4 News.